developing this morning. Folks, it has happened again. The U.S. military is shooting down another high-flying object. This time it happened Sunday over Lake Huron. It's a great lake between Canada, Canada and Michigan. Wake Up Charlotte's Bree Jackson now in Washington with what the Pentagon has said so far. Ben, the Pentagon is declining to describe these recent objects as balloons, but this is the fourth takedown in just eight days, and lawmakers on Capitol Hill say they're being left in the dark about the situation. The U.S. military shooting down a fourth unidentified high-altitude object Sunday, this time over Lake Huron. What's gone on the last, uh, you know, two weeks or so, ten days, has been uh, nothing short of um, craziness. And uh, the military needs to have a plan to not only determine uh, what's out there, but determine the dangers that go with it. President Biden ordering the takedown after military officials raised concerns about the object's path and altitude, saying it was a safety flight hazard and a threat due to its potential surveillance capabilities. This marks the third object blasted out of the sky in just three days. And comes a week after a Chinese surveillance balloon had Americans' eyes glued to the sky. They do appear somewhat trigger happy, although this is certainly preferable to the permissive environment that they showed when the Chinese spy balloon was coming over some of our most sensitive sites. Military leaders say the Pentagon has been more closely scrutinizing U.S. airspace. Officials are still collecting data to determine what the recent objects are as bipartisan calls for transparency grow. Why it's taking so long to, for number one, for, for me personally, to identify these objects too. Why is it taking so long for them to be shot down? In the absence of information, people's anxiety leads them into uh, potentially destructive areas. So I do hope that very soon the administration has a lot more information for all of us on what's going on. Lawmakers are pushing for a briefing on the unidentified flying objects. The Pentagon continues to search for debris and answers about their nature and purpose. And defense officials say there was no indication of aliens with these recent takedowns. In Washington, Bree Jackson, Wake Up Charlotte.